But the thing I kind of like about the slow pacedness is that they, you know, just sort of reminds me of Penumbra. Fuck, it's a lot of better. It's not good. Um, yeah, good thing we have night vision apparently. That always helps. Down we go into the depths of hell once more. And we'll get sold. Oh, you get. Oh, you're there, whispering to me again about shit I don't really care about. Oh, oh, I love that. Hell yeah. Okay. Well then. Time to replace the broken fuses. And... There we go. Shut up. Um... Come on. There we go. Fine now. Up. Oh. It's the fucking light. Are you trying to? What the fuck? What the fuck? Hey, hey, what the fuck? Okay. What the fuck? Okay, I guess there's someone in, in here with me. Um, yeah. Can we get back up? I guess we can. What the fuck was that? Careful. Don't get fucked. This is spooky. Save. Bitch. Oh yeah. This place just got a lot less disturbing. And thank fuck for that. We have a fucking running generator. Which is nice. But now what? I guess this uh those automated doors work now. Yeah, that's a good point. Check that out. Should I check that out? Yeah, I've been here too. Okay. So now that we got the electricity back, we should be going back to the um, archives area with the automated doors. As far as I know. Um, that would make sense. Also, it would be nice if it. If this place were lighted now, that would make sense since I just powered a huge fucking generator. And it would make sense if it provided light for this area. Right? I think so. <laughs> yeah. So could you please... Shine some light into the situation? Oh, thank god. <laughs> this music. Attention to station personnel. Power supply of the living compartment and adjacent residential buildings has been restored. If you notice any faults, please inform a member of the personnel with status code A or a technician. Thank you for your attention. Are you trying to imitate Shoda? <laughs> blah, blah, blah. You think we haven't noticed that everything has started to work? Yeah, exactly. Looking out of the voices, man. In before monster. <laughs> so, I wonder how many of these fucking work now. Still locked. 
God for all the fucking light. What would we do without the light? Was that blobby before? I'm not sure. Okay. So. So, 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 so. Anything changed here? And there's still the arrows, so I'm not really sure what they're trying to point out here. It's still very ambiguous. Not sure at all. This work right? Oh yeah. Okay. So why does this room even exist? Okay, let's take a look around. Is there some gas there or something? Weird like that. Here? going on over here still can't get a fucking drink what is this soda jolt right what's this hmm look I still need to find batteries you know can't survive without batteries seem to be more important than food at this point food and water which I don't seem to really need most of the time oh yes thank god oh I have lost health somehow but we'll just take some drugs and we'll be fine Simon appreciates art. I think that's his name, is it? Oh no. Is it Philip? Might be Philip actually. No. Simon's the one from Rife here. I can't even remember his name probably. <coughs> Something to do with that reports about compiling story information, okay. Right. It's a computer. Start that. Um, it won't boot the screen falls over there. Messages. Fuck. Um, not really sure what I'm looking for around here. I guess a way out. <laughs> Actually, I'm searching for a key card. Sir, sir, good sir. Come on, come on, come on, fucking 
Get the fucking axe. Get the fucking axe. Get the fucking axe. Oh fucking shit. I got a vent tool and I'm not afraid to use it. Uh, no, not quite right. Wait. Nope, nope, no, no, not not quite right. Um I wonder why you're just standing there not doing anything. This wind doesn't seem to work. I don't know why this collapsed on its own. Um what can I do here? Shit. What am I supposed to use this wind? Ventilation hatches. Ventilation hatches. Fuck. Fuck. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Yeah. Motherfucker. Mm. What the fuck? What's up with that guy? He didn't even attack. That's not good. He's fucking shit up. Scheiße! Scheiße! Oh! 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 Okay, 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 let me get the camera. Oh, fuck. Come on, come on, open this shit up. Fuck off. Oh, you need to get down here. Oh. What the fuck? Cyanide. Okay, good, he fucked off. We got the key card. And we got our human rights back. And that fucking thing scared the shit out of me. You better not move, you motherfucker. Okay. Hey, it's Jens. <laughs> The friction games for him. Okay. Cassette. My name is Alfred Richardson. I'm okay. a series of experiments related to the artifact which was found by the expedition. This is the third record. It's evening already, and I still can't collect my thoughts. I understand that I should stop the experiment, but I haven't even tried to open the artifact yet. So let's get started. I'm using a screwdriver to remove the lid. Let's try to open it. Okay. Oh hell! I dropped it. <laughs> nice. Seems undamaged. Well, it only confirms that simple physical impact won't open it. Enough for today. I'm tired. <laughs> I should think about more effective ways of opening it before bedtime. Man, is that screwed? I was so fucking tiring. Enough for today, man. I can't handle it anymore. <laughs> yep, it's so hard to place. Some articles related to flooding in Eastern Europe in all, July, August, 1997. Okay, let's fuck another side. Maybe that's a good thing. Now that we got the key card, um, our number one objective is, of course, to get the fucking shit out of here. To the fucking security room. Maybe we can obtain a shotgun from there. That would be nice. Okay, this motherfucker's gun bound to be around here. Don't know where, but I'm he's around. Will we save? To you too, bitch. Did I ever go up? I don't think I did. Yeah, you can have your little happy fun time over there. Okay, it doesn't open. Well, we got one place we can go to, and that is a security room. Guess we get access access car now, so let's go. Shall we? Did I go here? Oh yeah, we did go here. Okay, you can now close this, thanks. Okay. So, what's closed? What the fuck? Oh! Shay! 
Nice. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. I got kind of spooked because I wasn't ready for that. That was a very manly scream. Uh. <laughs> oh god. You better not fucking follow me. Alright. Security room. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Let's take a look, let's take a look, let's take a look! Okay, it looks like someone's computer is here. There's some shit going on here. Surveillance cameras and shit. Alright, there's some fucking spooky shit going on over there. Let's see, what's up? Glad to see you again. This is great luck that you managed to get here. I have two pieces of news. I think I'll start with a good one. I managed to contact a rescue group and told them about us. And now the bad one. You're not in the best place. Mm -hmm. There is an abandoned part of the shelter station close to you, and unfortunately, given the circumstances and destruction, you can only pass through there. Shit. I don't know what's waiting for you there, but even before the infection, there were many unpleasant rumors about this place. So you will have to check their validity with your own ass. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. Anyway, uh, there should be a comm radio in this room. Take it and wait for a signal from the rescue group. They will help you out. Be careful. Okay. Fuck. Philip, listen to me. There has to be another way. You heard yourself what they said about that place. Are you just going to forget about your old pal, Clarence? Did I not yes. deserve you to listen to me? No. Fucking ass. Okay. The recent events have puzzled the elevated cast and the staff. For some time, experiments have been performed at the station in order to develop a special acid that can cure the shell of a persona TARDIS artifact. But a week ago, the cast decided decided to stop the experiments. The day before this the decision, the de the day before the decision, Alfred Richardson, the biologist at the station, entered the lab and performed the experiment alone. I'm getting kind of tired here. During it, he fell into a coma from which he can wake up to this day. What? Okay. The reason for this turn of events is not clear so far and a certain group of scientists is engaging in clarifying the circumstances. Several scientists who were, who were often in contact with Alfred before the incident reported that he had been behaving strangely at least for a month before the tragic incident. Howard Lapfresk puts forth alleged theories about the nature of what happened, but so far those are merely speculations. Alfred has been assigned to, uh, has been assigned status code C, and when he wakes up from the coma, it, it's unlikely that the cast will reinstate him in his position. Well then, if he wakes up. Oh, great picture! I'm glad you took that. <sighs> I just want batteries, man. Batteries, one of this fucking radio, probably. Okay. What have I pressed the gummit isn't function since the call answer option is the only one that works? Okay. Well, let's get out of here then, right? It's a narrow band communications radio, huh? I remember putting on this before, yeah, we talked to Red with that. Mmm I don't know what we're supposed to do exactly now. Kind of a big yes thing. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I'm not sure. There's fucking security cameras everywhere. So we're supposed to go through some old aban uh, old abandoned part of this area. So where is that? Um, I think I'll have to. Oh. Hello. 
Do you copy? Yes. You must be Philip. I'm yeah, Julia Quan, the rescue group signal. Amabel told me about you. As you probably already know, you can only get out through an abandoned part of the station. Yes. I'll open the door for you. So which door did you open? Um... Oh! You mean... This one? Yes, there we go. Dozens of guesses were spinning inside my mind. I was waiting for yet another step into the unknown, but this one was frightening. It seems that Clarence knows more than what he says, but he is just as afraid as I am. Only the great desire to escape and find Amabel makes me go forward. There is no other way. Really? I guess we should find Amabel then. In before she is a fucking monster again. I wouldn't be too surprised. Fuck. Well, here we are in the abandoned area of this whole fucking shelter. But I think I'll end it here for tonight since it's pretty fucking late, it's like 7:30. So we'll continue next time. Goodbye.